Hey guys, what's up? Cranking them bass here. Today we're going to learn about my own personal knot that I like. I just made it up and stuff like that. And I haven't lost a lure, a fish, or anything like that. No big fish. So, let me show y'all. Alright, so first, pretend this was like the eye of the hook or something like that. So we just do like a regular knot. And then, we go back under the thing under the hook under the eye my bad do that again one more time and then we get the tag in and then we just loop it loop it around it like three times and then we just do another one of these things again it looks really good on like line and stuff but this is pretty bulky like it's pretty compact but that's what it sort of looks like like it has like the double string around it so like that will help help it so it's like a little bulky right here so let me show you one that's on a hook Alright guys, here's it with some braid and a hook. So, we just go through here. And then, we go back into the eye. Do it once again. Then three times, then we go one, two. So, whenever you're tying a fishing knot, you don't want to pull it like too tight because that will, like, um get the stress all out of the line and it could fray it like fluorocarbon or something like that and it'll lose all the string strength out of the knot in the line that you tied so this is what it looks like with the hook see it's like pretty compact and stuff like that it's a really good knot it's a strong knot so um, if you get if you learn something from this video Please hit a thumbs up and comment below if you have any other knots that you personally tie and can show me uh, and you just learned it from yourself. Uh, thanks for watching. See you next time and see you later.